Boys, what is going on and welcome back to another video and yet another objectives guide on the new Future Stars Rainier, I'm pretty sure it is. Boys, they have finally brought it back. If you don't remember last FIFA, they did it with Daniel James and I believe Martin Odegaard, where they gave like upgradable versions. You do smaller objectives to get the first card and then with that card, you obviously do the next objectives to ultimately get yourself a massive, massive card. And today, EA... What a card. 87 Future Stars Arena. He's got the pace. His dribbling, agility, and balance, I'm guessing, will look inc will be incredible. I mean, what a card, man. He will make a lot of people's teams. And for a free card, this will take ages to grind. But if you can grind this out, dudes, this will be sensational. So, if you guys don't know, with these uh, objective guys, we'll go over all of the objectives. And then I will build a little mini team or an example. Put you on the right track of the team. What, what the team means, the requirements, and all that good stuff. Remember, boys, as well, if you are new and you do want to help me out, a sub does go a long way. I want to try to get this done as quick as possible. It may be a little bit longer compared to some of my other objective guides because, obviously, there's 12 segments to this objective. So, starting off, you've got 28 days, 27 days, 23 hours to complete this objective. So, you've got a wee while to do this. So, do not worry. You can complete it over time. Maybe if you play champs and rivals on the weekend or rivals Monday, Tuesday, and then champs, obviously, on the weekend. Actually, you know, that wouldn't work, but I don't know. The, you can work throughout this, like work towards these objectives throughout the week. Just try to find some time because like I said, you do have that 28 days, so almost a full month. So first of all, score four goals using forwards in any game mode. Can be squad battles, can be friendlies, can be division rivals, champs, whatever game mode you want. It's simple. Four goals with forwards. So that's strikers and center forwards, right wings, left wings, left forwards and right forwards. And then you get yourself a 78 rated Reyna, which obviously isn't a great card. He's got 85 pace, 76 shooting, kind of basically like a normal Rashika card. So as easy as that, I shouldn't have to explain how to score four goals with forwards. And then what you do is score three goals using 78 overall Future Stars Reyna. So like I said, you will get the 78 in return, which you're then going to want to score three goals. Once again, squad battles, beginner score a hat-trick with him, put the controller down, and then you have gone ahead um, and obviously done that objective. Then you've got assist two goals, same thing, you get that in the exact same match, score using 78 Future Stars Arena in four separate matches to earn the 82 overall Future Stars Arena, which once again, this is where you get the next phase of the card. So basically, with the 78, you just got to score goals with forwards. Then after you get the 78, you just have to score in four separate matches, scoring three and assisting two. As easy as that. It can be any match you want. So squad battles, beginner difficulty. Basically, lots of people can obviously beat beginner. So happy days there. And with that 82 that you get in return, you're going to have to do assist free goals with through balls using 82 overall future stars Reina. So if you don't know what a through ball is, I know lots of you will. But if we use that don't, it is literally just triangle. Or Y if you are on Xbox, the one on the top out of the four buttons. And you just have to assist with that. Once again, the squad batters, beginner, you can get that done. Now assist four goals, which once again, you can get that done. But sadly, this does have to be in the managerial masterpiece game mode, which we will have a look at that in just a second. Next up is score using 82 overall future stars reina and six separate matches in the live foot friendly managerial masterpiece to earn the 85 rated so after you score in six separate matches and assist four goals so you're looking to score in six separate matches as well as assisting with the 82 rated card then you will go ahead and get the 85 rated card remember this is where the managerial masterpiece does come in so you do have to play online and like i said at the end of the video we will show you guys that managerial masterpiece game mode now also so uh, like i said yep that one and then score in six separate wins using 85 overall future stars reina which once again you will get that done you score in six separate matches if you win five of them then you get this one done as well so you can get i'd say majority of these done within a similar in a separate in a similar span of time you know you don't have to do them one by one for example like i said the score and assist and squad battles you'll get that done together whereas the 85 like you can score in six separate matches win six and assist four you'll get them done in maybe what 10 games if you can get a 50 percent win rate you'll get that done in 10 games or even less than that i think so honestly these are actually spot on, these are very easy right now, nothing too hard, the hardest one is literally scoring in 6 separate wins, it's going to be sweaty, because you don't have to score in a game, you have to score in a win, so you have to score and then obviously go on to win that game. Now then, score 6 finesse goals, 
using 85 overall rated Rena in the live foot friendly. Which, once again, is scoring six finesse goals will just come with time. You basically, you're want to, going to want to play managerial masterpiece and really focus on this card. Get for assists, get for wins, get for goals, get for through balls, and get those finesse shots. Which finesse shot was right bumper and shoot like normal. So as easy as that. Now, now it's kind of starting to level up a little bit. Score a brace. So you have to score two goals in three separate matches using 85 Future Stars Reyna. And now... One tip I will give you guys, right, is message your opponent. If you've got the PlayStation app, uh, if you don't, download it. You can message your opponent, copy and paste a message, and say, do you want to go to 10 10? Say you get the score to 10 10, right, and you both get all your objectives done, the fitness goals, you can score a brace with them, and then you can say, from 10 10, we can play it out from there. And that way, you guys can get all of it done. Obviously, you have to be on board. Your opponent has to be on board. If your opponent doesn't want to do it, then don't do it because it will like leave and be toxic. Um, but obviously, if you're both on board, this can speed up the process so, so much. So I would highly recommend that. Now, getting to the end here, we've only got two more objectives left. Score in 16 separate matches using 85 overall. Future Stars, Reina, which actually, I said score in six different ones, so... Basically, you just have to play a shit ton of games and play 25 games with Rainer on your starting lineup. So, moral of the story, lads. Managerial masterpiece. Score, assist, through balls, try score a brace in, was it, in three separate matches and finesse goals with him. So, like I said, managerial masterpiece will be the main worry or the main worry, the main objective. Let's move over to the objective scene. The scene, the squad builder. Boys, obviously the foot, uh, the managerial masterpiece game mode is capped at 77 rated. And as I said, the 78 one you just unlock by scoring three goals and four. So that one you don't have to worry about. But the 82 rated and 85 is what you will mainly be using for these managerial masterpiece objectives. Most of the time you will be using this 85 Raynar Future Stars card. So obviously you have to get him in the squad, of course, because he's the main dude to actually get your objectives done. Like I said, it's, like I said scoring finesse goals, assisting with through now like I said you've got a 77 max rating so you want to look for low rated players we're gonna like give you guys an example I'm not saying copy this exact team because it's not going to be the best team I've ever made but look for low rated players in your club whether it's Bundesliga like I'm doing now because obviously you want to get the links you want to get the full chem you can have a max of free silvers and you're not allowed any bronze players I have basically my club is empty but like I said get some lowish rated 82 is way too high so you'll have to narrow that down so get some highish rated uh, Bundesliga players in there like I said you want to be getting this rating down lads you need you can only only have a max of 77 I believe it is and still this isn't even a, a bad team but what you want to do as well is make sure you get the silvers in there lads because the silvers is what will basically save your ass in a sense because the 77 max rating these will bump it down a lot so just look at silvers Chong will be perfect because he's pacey as a left mid he would work fine um, you just want to be looking at lowest rated silvers of course to try bump it down you've obviously got centre mid 71 pace 73 dribbling not bad and I can give you a tip right now is um chem styles they will help you guys out a lot because the chem styles will basically boost them to probably low rated gold cards in game so i've got the two silvers in there we'll look for another silver and we'll just go ahead and choose a random silver left back silvers from the bundesliga will be going through the roof at the minute let's put him 77 pace actually you want like another tip as well you want to look for kind of pacey silvers for example 85 pace where you'll get him in the squad right now chuck him in there so we're at 77 rating but we've still got a spot here so i don't know you may have to narrow it down a little bit more just look at midfielders low to high in the bundesliga let's go ahead and chuck what's the card that looks all right bent lab bent lab he looks all right 64 pace not great but shooting dribbling is all good so we're at 80 rating like i said 80 rating is definitely not good we've already used our three silvers in our starting lineup so you want to you have to use a full bench of 75 rated cards to really get this rating down. So boys, we have built a team. Obviously, you're going to probably want to look at a different uh, center back. Maybe, obviously, not Ginter. I'd probably recommend uh, Boateng. Also, 82 rated, so you can put Boateng in place for him. And, obviously, any other right back that's not Bender with 60 pace. But just in my club, so it made it easier. But, as you can see, we have got that 77 rating cap. So, we are allowed to use this team. Uh, and, first of all, striker, low rated. Get him in your squad. Wang, he 
Jackie Chan. Freestyle skill moves, four star weak foot. This dude is incredible. I used him at the beginning of the game. He will come in huge for objectives. Like I said, he's probably going up in price because everyone has the exact same idea. He was probably, what, two, one K, one and a half K earlier. Actually, that was a lie. He hasn't really gone up at all. So happy days. So get one here, Chan. Like I said, a very sweaty card in there. Uh, Herman, we literally just needed to narrow the rating down. So he had no other uh, option with Herman. But like I said, you can look at other alternatives. Bentalab, Bentalab as well. Honestly, just your standard gold common center mid. Now, like I said, the goalie and defense is solid, but the main things that makes the squad is the strikers. And like I said, the most important key of the squad, it doesn't have to be a full Bundesliga squad, but it is most, it's most—it's going to be the easiest to build that Bundesliga squad. Obviously, getting Reynard through full chem and all of that. He's the main man. You want to just score goals with him, assist goals with him. Everyone else is literally just there to help you get the game done. Like I said, the massive tip to get a Reynard as low as you can is make sure your full bench is 75 rated cards we did just squeeze in i think we're one rating off one rating higher and it's a 78 rated squad we just fit in dennis who recently went to fc colin um which uh, once again a great super sub 92 pace he's got some solid uh, agility 88 so you can sub him on for maybe one he chan if he's getting tired change formations maybe sub him on sub him sub him on as a left cam right cam but make sure you get the free silver players in your starting squad they will get the rating as low as you can see if you put them on the bench the rating will start to go up i don't know it actually might not here no the rating doesn't go up so happy days but like you want to try get the silver players in your squad because then obviously you're less limited in other positions because if you can get the silver players in your squad you can narrow the overall squad rating down a lot and have an ultra super sub to sub on whether it's a cristiano ronaldo or something like that but uh overall boys Build a team, 77 rating max. Make sure you try get the at least usable silver players in. Like I said, Chong, 77 pace. I've seen worse silvers. This dude looks a well-rounded center mid and 85 pace left back. Probably chuck some chemistry styles on them because you will be using them for like 30 games, which, like I said, is basically a full weekend league. So a full weekend league in managerial masterpiece in a sense. It will be sweaty. It will be a massive grind. But like I said, a little bit of an overview on this, uh, how to complete these objectives is assist goals with or score with any forwards. You then unlock the first 78 rated card. With that 78 rated card, you have to do a little, a few more objectives, which you could probably get done in maybe three or four games. You then get an 82 rated card. With the 82 rated card, once again, a little bit more objectives, which will take roughly six games in the managerial masterpiece game mode, and you will unlock this 85 rated. And then with this 85 rated is the biggest grind of them all. You have to play 25 matches, score in at least 16 matches with him. I believe, was it score... Finesse shot goals and score a brace in three separate matches. Uh, assist with four through balls as well. So mainly, you want to be targeting him up front, don't you? You want to be getting the through ball assist. And overall, I would say the biggest tip of them all, lads, like I said, get the silvers and all that, but message your opponent as well. Ask if they want to help you, if you want to help each other out. You know, go to 10-10, get your uh, through balls done, get your uh, finesse shot goals done, all of that, and then you can say, let's play it out from there. This card looks exceptional, like 90 agility. He's rapid, some nice shooting. Six foot one, which I could, it's not even a worry, to be honest. Four star, four star. Looks an exceptional card. Boys, happy grinding. Good luck. Let me know down below if you've got any other questions I can try and answer. It's been your boy Davis, and until next time, lads, I'll see you later.